In the past, I would describe myself as a useless lump of clay. My first path was heroin. I got into that and then unfortunately got hooked. Without that so-called vitamin, I can't do anything. I still remember my mom start to look around. Is there any organization that can help me? And that is where by the first time when I hop into hiding place. Then I start to hear people singing hymns, singing praises to Jesus. I saw some big guys, full body of tattoo. Usually when we gather together, we talk about nonsense, but they are not. They are looking at a very thick book. They are singing praises to God. Whoa! And I felt it was something uh, um, a bit worried or scary to me. I thought that, oh no, my, my parents sent me to the wrong place. You know, maybe, maybe right now here is a, a you know, a, a, a mad people hospital, mental, mental hospital. So it is from there, I start to come to know a little bit of God. When the Bible says that you believe Jesus, you know, Son of God, you will have a free gift, internal life. I cannot accept. This realistic world, nothing is free. Everything needs to pay a price. But when I start to meet God, God assure me that come, come to know Him and you've been saved. From the day I want to know Him and, and it is from there, God started to mold me. I am now clean, almost 25 years to 30 years. I got a family of three kids, a lovely wife. I'm a co-owner, I'm a chef at Mumbo. Running a business during the pandemic is never easy. When it comes to trouble, worry is somehow human being tends to have that first thought. Those things that I cannot control, things like funds, I think that part I have to leave it to God. I strongly believe that if it is God's will, God will sustain the business. And it is not His will. I also strongly believe that He will take away. I think there's a lesson called fully trust, 100%. I need to have my 100% trust that God will move me and He's taking care of my journey. Maybe you felt that your life currently right now is broken. Today I'm going to encourage you, God is somebody that you can trust and He'll continue to move you just like what He did for me. Trust Him, believe Him, hold on to His promise. You will find that the journey will be internally beautiful.